hey everyone welcome back to my channel okay, my hair is washed and fresh and blow dried now today i'm so excited because i'm going to be doing um crochet locks of my hair from the company toyo tress um they sent me some hair and i'm loving it it's 36 inches y'all 36 inches so i'm going to try to do something new i'm going to leave some baby hairs what i call to be baby hairs but i don't really have baby hairs and my hairline is crazy you see right there um as i part around to get a little bit of hair out as y'all can see my hairline has a long hair in it and then right there um is really short hair in the corners so it looks like i'm bald but I'm not really bald, y'all. That's just how my hairline works. That's how it looks. So when I put it, <laughs> when I section this out, I'm trying to leave as little hair as possible because, you know, um, what I'm going to be doing, you, you can get heat damage or whatever, but I don't want that. So anyway, so look at all that hair. So um here is a product is the butterfly locks they're 36 inches long like what i love them i always wanted these 10 comes inside one pack and i think i had like eight to ten packs but look how long they are they smell good first of all you know how companies send you hair and they stink this didn't stink and it's easy it has a big loop for like thick hair so it's easy to install i like things that are easy and i'm not a pro with when it comes to crochet so i like something simple and easy i braided the front so it can look like i got box braids you know that's the thing going on um you want it to look as natural as possible or like um like you have the party the sectioning so I'm going to continue to do that and here's a little secret that I realized if you um, take the section that you're going to braid like an individual braid and you pull the hair forward not backward but forward and start braiding the hair forward down a little maybe like five times and then take the hair and go back so you can get a definite section or box braid you can see all the surrounding parts if you can see it looks like a um a box so you can see all the sections on each side now i'm going to take the hair and i'm just going to add the last braid to the braid that i'm doing currently and I'm going to do that to my entire head. And right here, I'm just making sure that I'm not really bald. That's not a bald spot. <laughs> <laughs> Every time I look at it, it looks so weird. I'm like, oh my god, I'm ba I'm Baldina. So I did that to my entire head. I'm just showing you how it came out. Boom, I crocheted my entire hair. It was so easy to do. So here's that loop making it easier. And if you need it to be wider, you could just pull that section down like I just showed you. And it'll just pop open easily. But I never had these before and I see them all the time and I never had anything as long as this and so it sits on your skin and when it sits on my skin I don't feel itchy it's skin friendly it doesn't feel itchy because you know how some hair like some braiding hair when I'm braiding I could just sit it on my lap and I start itching because it like pokes through my um, clothes and it makes it scratchy i don't like that but this hair doesn't do it i sleep with it at night it's not a problem and it's very soft and it's not heavy i can tell when i put in my well i did put a lot in my hair so you're going to feel some weight 
So if you don't want a lot in your hair, or if you don't want your hair to feel heavy, don't put a lot in. And here I'm just showing you how easy it is to just put the crochet in because I'm not a crochet pro. And some people out here, they are really great at it, but I'm just doing it. It's easy. It's just a hairstyle that I'm going to have for maybe two weeks. And I'm not going to do anything serious. I don't want a lot on my edges. Y'all know if you are my um, A1, A1 since day one supporter, you know that when it comes to my edges, I don't play and I don't put a lot of tension on them. So I'm just going to put add two to each of these. Here it is. Here's the finish. Well, not the finished look. Now I'm going to add some coconut oil to my hair. just to my scalp just to make sure that everything's good and not flaky but this hair I'm loving I'm so excited to wear it, especially in the summertime it's not even hot it I mean the hair it doesn't add you know how hair can be a lot and hot no I, I'm not really hot but I haven't really been outside I've been inside but i have been swimming with it and swimming with it is a little challenging swimming you try swimming with 36 inch hair okay so here's my wannabe baby hairs and i'm going to do something unique which i really don't see people doing i see people um they do like the fluffy baby hair but their hair is shorter so i'm just going to curl my hair and just try to create a different look because i know my hair does not stay in curls but i wanted to try and i wanted that like bohemian butterfly lock look you know something that looks effortless but you put a lot of effort into it but it doesn't look like you put a lot of effort into it that's the look i'm going for here um i really i just try to do something different you know and then I'm going to add some shining gem just to um, make the smaller hairs come out and show themselves so it won't look I'm, like I'm really bald, you know. See, you see how that laid it down and they came out. They came to play with the big dogs. Y'all, I want this to work out so bad, but it's not giving what it's supposed to give. But anyway, this um, Toyo Trust is the company and I'll have everything link down in the bio here is the finished look and as you can see my curls fail so i'm going to try different styles to make it look the best way that i want it also toya trust has a facebook group called every toya trust everyday benefits so if you guys want to go join that um go ahead and do that look at the hair oh my god it's 36 inches i'm excited about that they go all the way down to my knees y'all so i had a little idea that i'm going to take one of the leftover butterfly locks and i'm going to use it as a ponytail holder and then i'm just going to tie it around like knot it right there and after that i saw that um it was giving me like a little layer in the front so i tied it around twice and now like the pieces hang and you can see it's like the two pieces adding to my bang and I like that it gave like a layered look or a bang. Um, so I'm going to add two more pieces. And I just like the ponytail look. Um, I haven't really been wearing it down. I wear it down before I go to sleep or um, I use a bonnet. But I really don't wear it down. But it is, it's, you would think this was heavy, but it's not heavy. And I'm just loving this look. Everything turned out the way that I wanted. Um, I put on some makeup and my little chains. I think I'm doing something because I'm feeling myself. But I thank you guys for watching. The link will be down in the bio for Toyo Tress website so you can get this hair. Um, join that Facebook group if you like and I just thank you guys for watching been a couple of days Maybe about a week and I just like wearing them like this now 
because there's no heat damage or anything. So they're super long and I love it. You see their little curlies and I put them up here. Just a different look. 